Hi and welcome to another Wiggly Wild show and um, this Wednesday we're going to be looking at my beautiful hissing cockroaches. Um, I've got two here as an example um, but I'm going to be focusing on the female. This female um, I've named her Mrs Heimlich because she was actually just called Heimlich from Bugs Life and then I discovered she was a girl because what she did was um, not only does she not have these raised little horns on the top of her head, so that would mean she was male. But also, after being handled by lots of children and um, and also teachers, she stuck a white thing out of her bottom end, and this was actually an egg sac, so I knew she was pregnant. Um, and I believe she's pregnant again, she's looking quite fat. And what cockroaches do is, because they're such good mums, they keep their eggs inside them until they're ready to hatch and by doing that they're really safe and warm the whole time and then when they're ready to hatch they come out alive so they're one of the few invertebrates that gives life and um, gives birth to live young and then they will shed their skin several times until they grow to be of this size and 99% of cockroach species are not pests so there's no reason to be like fearful of them and they're just doing a really good job by eating lots of dead leaves and everything out in the forest. Particularly these ones can't even fly. These are Madagascan hissing cockroaches. And they hiss by squeezing their bodies very quickly and all of the spiracles that they breathe out of on the sides of their bodies, um, the air comes out of them very quickly like a kettle and that's what causes the hissing sound. Um, so hopefully they'll make you look a little bit differently at cockroaches. And um, you can understand where the myth of if you step on a cockroach lots of babies comes out comes from because um, that's just people that have stepped on mother cockroaches that are ready to release their babies. So join us for another Wiggly Wild Wednesday in a couple of weeks where we'll be looking at a different animal who will also be a safe and friendly one to have a look at.